Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Sammy Ketchum, and welcome back to Sammy Ketchum TCG. All right, guys. Today, I am going to be talking about Card Fight Vanguard. Well, this is basically going to be an intro video for Card Fight Vanguard. Um, I'm going to be I'm going to be telling you guys about um, myself. <laughs> um, basically, um, where I started in Vanguard. Um, a little bit of my history. Um, um, some of the decks and things that I've played. Some of the decks that I will be playing in the future. Also, we'll be talking about like some of the mats and things that I've, you know, that I've gotten, you know, by playing Vanguard, things like that. Um, and then, and then, last but not least, I'll talk about um, some of the content that I'm going to be bringing out later for you guys. Um, so, <laughs> hopefully, this won't be too long. So let's just jump right into it. All right. Um, first, let's go into a little bit of history. Um, I started um, Vanguard um, about like 2011, 2012, basically when the game first took off. Um, one of my friends had um, mentioned, you know, this game to me, had gotten me into the game, you know, had told me that um, one of the local card shops was basically going to be doing Vanguard. And I was like, okay, you know, I'll, you know, I'll look into it, and so I did, you know, um, then, um, I think about like a week or two weeks later, I went to, um, YCS Atlanta, because I used to play Yu-Gi-Oh! too, um, I went to YCS Atlanta, participated in that, and while I was participating, um, there were people doing, um, demos of Vanguard before it actually started up. And um, so I took a look at that and saw them going over the mechanics and some of the rules and stuff. And I was like, okay, cool. And they told me that people will be, they told me that stores will be starting demos and giving out starter decks about a week or a week, to, a week or two after the YCS. So I was like, okay, I'll look forward to that when I go back down to Charlotte. So, you know, a week or two later came and one of the shops that I was, um, you know, playing cards at, of course, was doing a demo. Um, I got me a free trial deck, entered the tournament, played in the tournament, did well, learned how to play Vanguard. Um, with, of course, a War Paladin trial deck um which you know War Paladin is now one of my main clans um so I did that and then um somebody um one of my friends told me to check out the anime you know because I was like I was like when you have a card game and you have an anime like Yu-Gi-Oh and you're like yeah they're like basically it's basically it's like the anime and the card game is kind of like Yu-Gi-Oh a little bit but they said it's better. So I was like, I was like, the anime is better than Yu-Gi-Oh? I was like, you gotta be kidding me. You know what I'm saying? Because the Yu-Gi-Oh anime is like amazing. Or it used to be amazing, especially like, you know, season zero, season one of Yu-Gi-Oh. I mean, you know, I, 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 I love them. They're just like pure nostalgia. But, um, but so moving forward, I checked out the anime. You know, started by watching season one of Vanguard, and I, I have to say I was blown away. I loved it. And then the rest is basically history. Started playing Vanguard. Um, I basically, you know, jumped right in, had fun with the game. Um, yeah, had fun with the game. Most of the clans I played, I basically played the clans 
that the um that the main people played on the show. So if Aichi played War Paladins, I played War Paladins. And as they went, as they progressed in the show, I also kind of progressed and, you know, gotten better cards and, you know, and I really tried to make those decks work, which I, I did pretty well. Um, when I just switched to Gold Paladins, um, when the store got the Gold Paladins and stuff, I, I, I switched to Gold Paladins. <laughs> um, so I did that. Um, I also played um, Bermudas. I played um, Deep Police for a little bit. I also played um, I played Oracle Think Tank because I love to draw with Oracle Think Tank. So I did that for a little bit um, with the um, Battle Sisters. I love the Battle Sisters. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, especially um, Battle Sister Cookie, Cookies and Cream. Oh man. <laughs> oh my gosh, that just made me hungry. <laughs> um, I also played Shadow Paladins. When I went to Shadow Paladins, I played Shadow Paladins too. <laughs> so yeah, I played a little bit of everything, just about. Um, and then when the car, when the when the um, when the show moved to the G series, I also played the G series. Um, I played Gear Chronicle. Gear Chronicle was basically probably one of my favorite clans to play. Um, play Gear Chronicle. Um, I dabbled no no Kami a little bit. I think I even I even had Kaggle for for a hot minute. But um but dabbled with no Kami. Um I don't think I really touched um Brave War Paladins though. I didn't I didn't touch Brave War Paladins too much. Um I I really didn't I really didn't mess with me on that there. Um, what else? Um, trying to think of something I didn't touch, but but yeah, but mostly the mostly clans that I really played were Royal Paladin, Gold Paladin, Gear Chronicle, and probably Bermuda. Those are basically probably my main four clans. I mean, I, I mean, I played a lot. <laughs> I played a lot of Vanguard. I played a lot of card games, you know, at, you know, really, well, at the time, really one shot. Um, went to multiple um, BCSs, um, every, basically every year from 2012 up to 2016 to 2017, I, you know, basically went to like regionals, Spring Fest, um, the 3v3 tournaments, things like that. Um, yeah, I, I really, I really wanted to do well and compete with Vanguard, and it showed. Um, some of the mats I have here <laughs> are really iconic and cool. From when I first started Vanguard, this is actually the first mat that I ever had made playing Vanguard. Um, this was made by the shop that I the shop that I basically went to on um, GSG. Um, yep, yeah. <laughs> has my name at the top. <laughs> the People's Champ has um, Aichi and Kai on it. Um, basically, they were both kind of my personas. I loved Aichi and Kai both, so I got them both on the mat. Um, I love. I love, I love, I love Aichi's persona the best, but I love saying final turn like Kai. So, <laughs> that's, that's what, um, those are the type of characters that I kind of like, you know, that resemble me. Um, this mat right here is, um, one of the mats um, my friends gave one of my mats one of my friends gave me. Um, of course, it's from one of the ARG state championships. Um, it's a top eight mat, so he got top eight in this event. Um, my friend 
um, the friend that gave me this mat, he um, used to be on, um, we used to be on the team together, um, Team Sentinel. Um, team Sentinel was actually a pretty decent team um, in the area. Um, they actually, one of the YCS, not one of the YCS, one of the BCSs that we went to, um, they, we had two teams, um, Team Sentinel A and Team Sentinel B. Um, me and my friend were on Team Sentinel B with, um, with one more person. Um, but he gave me this mat when he saw me, I think about maybe like a year later. And so I can remember him by because we really had great times together as a team. Um, so, um, me and actually, well, the team, well, Ah, Team Sentinel B, we were basically the only team that um, got the furthest. We got the top 16 at that um, at that um, BCS in Atlanta, which was very, very good, which I was really proud of. Um, um, I, myself, I was playing um, World Paladins. No, no, not World Paladins. I was playing Golds. <laughs> I was playing Gold Paladins. Um, let's see, Alfred... Sanctuary Liberator Alfred. <laughs> I don't even think I'm saying that right. <laughs> um, yeah. But I was playing on um, Liberator Alfred, um, Liberate the Lock, and at the time, um, Link Joker. Link Joker was basically, you know, the big thing. So when they were locking everybody or locking all, all my opponents and locking my friends, I was like, I was basically the only, one of the only decks that could unlock their units, you know, with, with the Liberator. So I was like, okay, cool. You know, so I'm unlocking my opponent. I think one of my, one of my teammates was playing, um, either, um, Spy Brothers or Narukami or something. I actually forgot what they were playing, but, you know, but I was playing Liberators. So that was really fun. Um, fun times. I, I really love going to regionals. Um, this mat here, this is actually probably my most recent mat. Um, uh, I think about like, was it like five months ago, I think? I had, um, no, not five months ago. This was actually last year. Um, last year, I would say around June, July last year. Um, I tried to get back into Vanguard and I started playing um, I started playing World Paladins again. Um, what did I play? I played um, the Six Crit Blaster Engine with the um, Monarch Alfred, the new Monarch Alfred that basically says that um, one of his effects is, is that when you drive check, um, when you drive check, if you drive, if you drove check a blaster, you could call it to the field. And then if um, you have five different blasters on the field, for each blaster you have, he gets a crit. <laughs> so, that yeah, I, I played that. And, and that was pretty fun. But then, um, unfortunately, I sold that deck off so I could have money to go to the Pokemon World Championships, which I have to say, by the way, was absolutely worth it. <laughs> Um, even though I did love that deck, but going to the Pokemon World Championships is definitely worth it. So, you know, I'll take that. Um, all right, this mat, um, here I got from the ARG Circuit Series back in 2016 um i think i forgot what i was playing in but of course it was it was at one of the convention centers that i played in <laughs> yeah of course it's one of the um it's one of the kagawa dragons one of the goat dragons yeah this is probably one of the more popular decks at the time but yeah i honestly really love competing in vanguard it's one of my favorite times 
Let's move on to some of the decks that I play, or I still have some of the decks that I used to play with. Let's see here. See, this is this is my one of my gold paladin decks well my oldest gold paladin deck that I turned into a stride deck great silver wolf gamor and wolf fang liberator gamor <laughs> yeah I love I love playing with gamor in gold paladins um, but yeah, yeah, I love playing Go Paladins. They're one of my favorite decks of all time. Um, little known fact, um, that, um, when we have, when, when, um, everybody was doing like the, um, clan leader thing, um, at the shops, um, my shop had a, um, my shop used to have clan leader tournaments, big clan leader tournaments where like, 50 to 100 people would come out and they compete and um, wh which whoever whoever won the most games um, whatever deck that they played with they would become leaders of that um, clan and then after that big tournament um, what you could do is that whoever was that clan leader for that tournament People could go up and challenge that clan leader for the for the um, title, you know. So, um, so we, so what happened was is that um, I um, I think it was one week I challenged the gold paladin clan leader to to a battle, you know, for for his title, and we have to play a series of five games. So basically, a series of five games, best out of five, well, three out of five would win and become become the new clan leader. So, um, so what ended up happening was is that um, I challenged him, and we were supposed to play on the weekend. You know. So one day I got off work. Um, it was the Friday, the Friday before the challenge. The Friday before the challenge on Saturday, I went to the shop to get my cards so I could play test, you know, that night before Saturday. What ended up happening was that the guy who the guy who I challenged, he was there Friday. And he was like, you know what? Why don't you just challenge me right now? And I'm like, I don't want to challenge you right now. <laughs> I'm gonna practice so I could challenge you tomorrow. He was like, you know what? Just go ahead and get it out the way. And I'm like, you know, I was like, since you're being so persistent, okay, I'll challenge you right now <laughs> for the title. And I ended up challenging him that night. And then, you know, by a sheer miracle, I ended up winning the gold paladin clan leader spot that night, which was amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. You know, like... It was like an amazing experience, something that I'll never forget for the rest of my life. Actually becoming a clan leader. That's something that, you know, like 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 if you're if you're a Vanguard player, that's something that you would want, you know. So, you know, I love that. Uh, let's see what else. Um, of course, play Gear Chronicle. I have some next stages. Chrono Dran. I had these in sleeves, but this is basically makeshift that Chrono Jet. Oh, Chrono Jet Dragons. Um, this one is like signed. They they're probably like really warped because I played with them a lot. One of my favorite decks. Some strides. Attack of Phoenix. Umaru. 
see. Luga Ur. Steam Breath. Yeah. I love Gear Chronicle. I love, I love, um, I love the mechanic time leap, time leaping things, and, um, putting my opponent's, um, rear guards, um, to the bottom of their deck. I love that mechanic. Um, let's see. I have. Wow. I also have um, a World Paladin deck. Um, this is basically the um, the Aichi. Um, this is basically the Aichi deck. The um, the Aichi. The Aichi. Um, what is it? The 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 I the, mm, the Aichi Legend deck. Yes, this is the Aichi Legend deck with. Um, let's see. With um, Blaster Blade XC. Yeah, so this is the IT Legend deck. Um, if I wanted to, I could play Premium with this. Um, let's see, I got. Of course, I got the strides for it. Ow. Um, so I have that willpower. Ah! No! <laughs> oh God! <laughs> the one thing you hate to happen is that you drop, you drop your, you drop your cards, or you drop your sleeves, especially when you have slippery sleeves or new sleeves. These are brand new sleeves, by the way. <laughs> I'll clean that up later. <laughs> um, I've got me some gift cards. Um, these were when I played like the World Paladins, but I could still use them. The four skiff markers. Um, force, force two. Uh, let's see what else do I have. Oh, more World Paladin stuff. Common stuff. Go Paladin stuff. Let's see. Oh, my Go Paladin strides. Garmors, Garmor strides. Let's see. Ray Breath Dragon. Ooh, Slay Me Flare. <laughs> Neck me. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. I think I should wrap it up about now. All right. Let's see. All right. Um, well, basically, that about does it for us, guys. Um, I hope you guys um, like it and enjoy um, enjoyed most of the stuff that I talked about today. Um, later on, I'm going to be doing... Um, not later on, but yes, later on, <laughs> um, probably, probably next week, I think I'll be bringing out a, um, deck profile on Gear Chronicle, a Gear Chronicle deck profile. Um, I'll also be getting my Gear Chronicle stuff because I'm going to be start playing Gear Chronicle again. Um, so I'll be bringing that to you probably like next week. Um. Uh, I'll also be doing something else special um, for Card Fight Vanguard. I'm not going to reveal what it is, so just yet. But I will be doing something for something special for Vanguard. Actually, before I do the um, deck profile, so look forward to that. Um, all right, guys. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and as always, make sure you take care of yourself and each other. Thank you.